town for, and, and what have your initial impressions been of the city? And um, I actually just got back in town last night. Uh, I'm gonna be around for a while. You know, that's the whole. I mean, purpose of me being here to, to work out with uh, some of the coaches and uh, and also get a, a good feel of the city. You know, uh, learn my way around. You haven't been with the team long and hard. They've got you out in the community. Just talk about getting to be a part of not only just the team, but the community and helping these kids. Um, I mean, it's very important for me. I mean, last summer I got the community assist award, you know, for the NBA and, you know, uh, playing behind, you know, guys like Dwayne, Udonis, Alonzo Morning, guys that always gave back to the community, you know, didn't do nothing for me, but want me to do the same thing, you know, not just in my own community, but the communities I play in. And uh, it's important because you got a lot of young kids, you know, uh, that look up to us. and. And once the opportunity to play in this league, and you know, I can answer some of the questions and also be around some kids that's never been around professional athletes. Hey, Kawhi, I gotta ask you. I mean, there's a thunder overall. We're seeing a lot of national love. I mean, with the young trio and all the potential. I don't know what happened last year. I mean, me and the guys and how you may fit in. What is your impression? I miss a great team. You know, uh, you had me. I mean, you had another shooter. You know, uh, one of the up and coming three point shooters in this game. You got a lot of guys on that team like KD. You know, Russ and, excuse me, Jeff Green, guys that uh, has made a great name for themselves in this league, you know, two, three years in already. So, you know, it's, hopefully I'm here, I'm going to be here to take a lot off them, you know, knowing that they carry a big load of, a, I mean, for our team and for me to come in and be able to, you know, uh, expand a little bit and help the team out. What's the biggest adjustment that, you know, at, you would face or really any any guy would face just coming into a new situation uh, just, like this? I mean, the biggest adjustment for me is the team chemistry. You know, you know, you got a lot of guys that's been playing together for the last couple of years, and you know, for me to come in and you know play my role is just important for me. You know, to play the role that's given to me, at, you know, uh, on this team. You know, not to come in and try to do too much, just do enough to be uh, to be a part of the team. Talk, you talk about chemistry. It seems like a lot of these guys are, are best friends too. Have you been able to meet with them? And then, what do you know about them and their relationship and how you fit in there? I mean, what makes it easy for me is that I know a lot of these guys from the AAU circuit. You know, uh, a lot of the basketball camps, ABCD camps. Uh, of course, me and KD uh, played in the McDonald's All-American game together. So, you know, I already had the opportunity to be around these guys before we got to the NBA. So, you know, and we all the same age, you know, which is really great, too. Cause, so we can also all hang out and, you know, uh, get along with a lot of things. You know Byron just from the... Ohio State pipeline. I know you guys. Uh, no, actually, I know Byron before then. Uh, like an AAU high school, you know, we played against scrimmage against each other up at Ohio State camp. So, uh, me and him got a pretty good relationship outside of Ohio State. How much longer you gonna be around? I'm here for a while. You know, I, I, I'm moving my house this this week coming up, so um, I'm gonna be here, not really decorating. You know, I'm gonna lead it up to my mom, but um, <laughs> I'm gonna be around just working out. And like I said, just sightseeing and getting a good feeling for the city. Anybody else here helping you out? Um, just, I mean, it's just my mom. Uh, I know a lot of guys are still out of town right now, you know, which, uh, I mean, we've been texting from time to time to see when we're going to be all catch up and be here at the same time. But um, I think I'll be here. I think Eric be here today sometime. Uh, and that's about it right now. What kind of things are you trying to work on? Basically, individual work. Individual is just off the dribble more than anything. You know, I know I can, I'm a standstill shooter and can knock down that. It's more about me expanding my game, getting to the basket. I can shoot, I can shoot free throws real good, so getting a chance to get to the basket and draw fast. What do, what do you think of your former team? What the noise that they made? said what? The, your former team and some of the things that they've played. Uh, I mean, they made a lot of noise. I mean, <laughs> so they, I mean, you know, Coach Riley's always been the type of guy that, you know, uh, put masterpieces together like he did, you know, and, um, you know, Miami's looking, you know, to win the championship and uh, with a lot of veteran guys and, you know, there's something they have going on down there, you know, I mean, wish them best of luck. Do you have an idea that was going to happen when they decided to trade you, that they were, maybe that was, they were clearing out that room to uh -huh. make a run? I didn't think that big of a run, you know, but... <laughs> It's, it's funny because, you know, nowadays people make jokes about how I got traded. At least I know I got traded, you know, for LeBron James, you know. It's, it's just funny how <laughs> a lot of people are making jokes about that now. What, you, you were in Orlando for the summer league. I mean, was that, 
I know you're working out, but just to be around some of the younger guys who are going to stick on the roster. I mean, I mean is that yeah, that's, good it's, experience. Yeah, it's very great experience for me. You know, it's important for me to be around the guys. You know, in all time. You know, just to show my support and show that I'm 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 all the way in 100. percent You know, and uh, just going out there working out with, with Kevin and uh, some of the other guys was just important, just to show that I was all the way in 100. percent do you feel you blend in with this team? I mean, you, you feel like you're the same age as these guys. Do you feel like your skill set is similar to what? Oh yeah, you know? I mean it is. It is. I mean, playing in Miami, my skill set, my skills wasn't as expanded as I know they can be. You know, because you know you have a guy in Dwayne Wade, you know, who had a lot of attention and the ball was in his hand most of the time. But here, you know, I'm gonna get an opportunity, you know, to expand my game. And what's important is. Uh, I'm, I'm more than just a shooter, you know, and I've always been. So it's just important for me to work on the things and just to get back into the habit of doing the things I was doing. If you can develop off the dribble, will that just lead you more open chances? Yeah, like yeah, it will. It will. I mean, it's not that I can't go off the dribble, it's just that I haven't really been, I've been settling a lot for the jump shot. So it's just important to me, you know, just going back to my, my rituals of what I've been doing. From what you know, I mean, the, the way the offenses are run here mm -hmm. as opposed to what you did in Miami, are there, is it a real stark? Contrast or? No, not really. I mean, like I said, in Miami, I was a standstill more than anything. In this, in this offense, there's a lot more movement. You know, uh, like I said, you got a lot more guys, you know, creating for other guys. You know, and with me, I mean, it's going to be easy because I can find the ball, you know, being able to move and being free, you know, being able to play my game. Hey, Quinn, I got to ask you, being from another part of the country, I mean, what was your perception of Oklahoma City and uh, what was your shock not to uh, play? It's, it's hard to say. Uh, to be honest, I thought it was going to be a lot of cows and horses and a lot of open field here, but I haven't actually seen a lot of farms and animals yet. But um, as you know, it's a lot different from Miami. The city is a lot, you know, slower. I mean, which which will help me out a lot. You know, I think this being here will keep me a lot more focused. You know, uh, by me uh, being here and you know, it's a lot more quiet than it is in Miami.